Hello and here are the latest global LGBTI news headlines from Pink 60. The LGBT community of Haiti are witnessing a rising tide of violence with two murders and at least six disappearances in October. The shooting of a transmasculine police officer is the latest in a long list of hate crimes poorly served by the authorities. After months convincing the Argentine Football Federation that she has no physical advantages, Mara Gomez became the first trans woman to play pro football on Monday. Her team, Villa San Carlos, lost by seven goals to one. Government officials say they will comply with FIFA rules on tolerance inside the stadium during the 2022 World Cup in Qatar. Rainbow flags will be permitted and fans are asked to respect local laws and attitudes outside during their visit. Sydney Gay and Lesbian Mardi Gras are selling an extra 23,000 parade tickets after the host venue was cleared for 100% capacity. They also added a free 2,000 ticket draw for people financially impacted by the pandemic. And finally, Charlize Theron has supported a suggestion that she star in a lesbian remake of Christmas favourite Die Hard. She responded, where do I sign to the fan proposal on Twitter, causing a social firestorm. Well, that's all from us for today. Join us again next time for more of the latest LGBTI news headlines.